Okay, so I've got my scoop coater. I'm gonna fill it with the photo emulsion. You can see it's this nice green color after you've mixed it. And I just want enough that I can coat both sides really well. This stuff, by the way, will save for months in the fridge. I've gone as long as a year and it's been okay. I think they only recommend months. And then I've laid out some newspaper just in case I make a mess. And I'm gonna carefully coat both sides. And I'm gonna, for this one, I'm just gonna coat the whole screen or just about the whole screen. So I'm just leaning it down until the bead of uh, emulsion touches the whole thing. And then a reasonably smooth stroke, bring it up. And I've tilted it when I get to the top so I'm not spilling lots of it at the top. And I'll do the same. You can see part of it I'm covering twice here and that's fine. That's just scraping across the surface. And you can see where, where that, there's a bead here of it that I'm just gonna scrape off. That's fine to scrape multiple times. You're just making a really thin layer of it if you scrape, scrape multiple times. And that's all we want anyway. And the inside, I'm going to go almost all the way to the bottom. If I go all the way to the bottom, there's going to be a bead of emulsion that's going to be hard to get out. Usually my artwork won't go all the way to the bottom anyway, so um, it doesn't matter so much. Okay, so I'll clean off the excess. Different, different people do this different ways. Some people only code one side. For the exposure times I'll be suggesting, um, I always uh, code both sides and scrape it super thin. And then usually I'll just look at it in the light to see that it's pretty even coating. There's not big, big streaks. A little streaking, so I think I'll just scrape a little more. Put mine in the attic. Got a nice dark attic, a little messy. There's room for me here. Put it somewhere where it's not touching anything and leaving it standing up to dry. Um, I've got a thin enough layer of, of emulsion on there that it's not going to drip down as it's drying. So it doesn't matter if I dry it vertically or, or flat, horizontally really. Um, I'll let it dry for about uh, probably an hour and a half or so. If I had a fan running in there, I could put a fan in um, as long as it wasn't blowing up too much dust. Uh, it would dry in about 40 minutes. And then the um, photo emulsion that you didn't use, still in the scoop coater, you can recover carefully back into the jar of photo emulsion. So you're really only using a little. Most of it will go back in. You definitely don't want to waste that because it's a little bit expensive. 